Hey Journey family, it's Pastor Dave here. Just wanted to give you a quick update on the Journey Forward campaign. I'm gonna talk really, really fast because there is a lot of information to share and I'm gonna try to do it as quickly as possible so you don't have to continue to watch a 25 and a half minute video. I don't know. One of the things that we released this Sunday was this campaign guide and information booklet. I'd love for you to take a look through that and see what's going on in there. Uh, Emily Williamson did an amazing job designing this and uh, just take a look at it. Uh, if you want one of these and you did not pick it up on Sunday, give it a week. We have mailed some out. If you still do not receive one, you can contact the church office and we will physically mail you a copy of this. Or you can go to journeyman.org and you can see on the uh, the bottom of the screen there, you'll be able to click on the Journey Forward campaign button. And this is a PDF inside of there also. So take a look at that. One of the pages or two of the pages that I'm really excited about are these pages right here designed by Frank Romuto. And uh, Frank did an amazing job just giving us some concept ideas ideas and drawings and some possibilities of what the building may look like. Again, we know it's a concept and a possibility is because of this picture right here. We probably will not have a swimming pool inside of the Journey Center. My middle school kid, that's all she talked about as soon as she saw this book. She was so excited and I had to break the news to her. That's just for fun. We probably won't have that. So, oh well. I know, I'm bummed too, but it could be fun. So take a look at that campaign guide and information booklet, and uh, let me know if you have any questions about that. If you Again, if you do want a physical copy and you did not get one, let me know, and we will uh, snail mail one to you. Another thing that you should be looking at is the important events that are taking place on Sunday, I double dog dared you to show up to every single Sunday that's here in January and February because there is going to be some amazing uh, opportunities, some amazing ministry moments, some amazing celebrations that are going to be taking place. Speaking of celebration, look at this one right here, Sunday, February 6th, the celebration Sunday. We're having famous Dave's barbecue and sweet afterthoughts desserts uh, during that celebration. So come with your family and celebrate with us what Journey, what Journey is doing and what God is doing through Journey. Uh, on that Sunday. Another thing that you may be interested in is this right here, creative strategies and giving. There is a lot of great information in here. One of the pages that I want you to specifically look at is this one right here. Myself, my wife, Danielle, our spiritual leadership team, our Journey Ministries leadership team, we have been praying this prayer for a while. God, what do you want to do through me? And we're inviting now the body of Christ, Journey Ministries, to, in, to, uh, to intentionally pray that prayer. Uh, we believe in it so much that we actually made some window clings. And uh, these window clings can go someplace on your, ah, got it, someplace in your house or in your car where you're going to see it as an entire family. Um, my wife and I and our family, we spend a lot of time at the refrigerator. So where this is going to go on the middle of the refrigerator for us to remember. Again, it's window cling, so you can stick it pretty much anywhere and it will stick right there. Uh, those are going to be mailed out in this envelope right here. And inside of this envelope is an invitation to gather together at the Advanced Commitments Gatherings. Again, this envelope is going to any um, active participant of Journey Ministries. And so if you are participating in the services, whether it be online or in person, one of these should be mailed to you. If you are participating in giving, uh, through uh, through Journey Ministries and, and wor uh, through that act of worship of giving, one of these should be mailed to you. If you are actively participating in serving, whether it be on the kids ministry team, the youth ministry team, the security team, the finance team, the setup and teardown team, someplace where you're actively serving within Journey Ministries, one of these should be mailed to you. And inside of that is going to be the invitation to gather together on January 30th or 31st. There's going to be four gatherings taking place and you have been assigned to one one of the gatherings and your host will contact you and check your RSVP and make sure that you're able to attend and it's just going to be a good time for us to gather together as the body of Christ in small groups and hear more of this vision and idea about what the Journey Center is all about and why we're doing what we're doing. Again, remember Journey Ministries is the body of Christ. We are participating together in a faith-based community and actively serving and giving and loving and uh, caring for the body of Christ, but also the community we live in. And again, it's all for God's glory and for God's kingdom. And the Journey Center, this building that we are building and adding on to, this is simply a tool to be used to get the gospel of Jesus Christ into all of the world.